in the last two chapters we saw what is gate level simulation and why a gate level simulation is needed in this chapter we will try to understand the types of gate level simulation the first type of gate level simulation is a zero delay simulation zero delay simulation means simulating the net netlist without annotating any timing data it is mainly meant for checking and validating the functionality of the design once it is translated into gate level netlist in zero delay simulation the specified block delays are ignored these kinds of simulations are much faster than simulation with timing and can be started early in your design cycle when netlist is not yet frozen or you do not have the timing information available the zero delay simulation can be enabled using the no specify switch or by adding delay mode zero in your command line as i mentioned the simulations are much faster than simulation with timing and can be started early in your design cycle the second one is unit delay simulation unit delay simulation operates on the assumption that all elements in the circuit process identical delay times hence providing any random delay values is similar to adding a unit delay this has an advantage that this is easier to implement than an sdf simulation zero delay simulations can induce false race conditions and zero delay loops the simulator ignores all module part delay information and timing check and converts all non zero structural and continuous assignment delay expression to a unit delay of one simulation time so this is a trade off between a zero delay simulation and an actual sdf simulation the sdf simulation is an actual delay simulation where the delay specified in the sdf file is annotated into your nets of the design and the timing checks are carried out this type of simulation is much more slower than a zero delay or a unit delay simulation but this is considered as a sign off for the product so to conclude unit and zero delay simulation is used in early stages of your design cycle but to sign off the product you need to do sdf based simulation